Hello friends, in this video I am going to discuss why law in hotel study course. Most of the students might remain confused that what the hell law doing in their hotel study course? What is the importance of law in their course? It is really difficult for them to establish a link between the law and their hotel study program. Therefore, in this video, I attempted to solve that confusion and also make them aware the meaning of law in their study program as well as future benefit. To understand the meaning of law and how it is related with the hotel study program, let's first understand the hotel business in brief that will help you to understand the whole concept. However, before explaining the meaning and concept, I would like to insert my disclaimer. That is, the information shared in this video is completely based on my personal research, study, and experience. So, don't take it granted. There may be many things beyond this, but I ensure it is very much informative for the beginners. Now come to the question, what is a hotel? Hotel fundamentally is an establishment that provides accommodation, meals, not essentially, and other services such as vehicles, guides, etc. to the travelers and tourists. Now the next question is, what is all about hotel business? All the activities and services which are offered and provided by a hotel in respect of its employees as well as guests, collectively known as hotel business. In fact, hotel is the most essential element of tourism and for the tourists. As the culture of tourism is growing, the number of hotels is also growing proportionately across the world and gradually it is becoming an employment hub for many youngsters who went their career in a hotel business. After understanding this point, now the question is, how is the law related to hotel study program? To run a hotel business, dozens of elements are required which are directly or indirectly related to the law. As for example, hotel project, this is the primary step that you need to clear. Hence, for this, first you need to understand what are the requirements of your project. Who will pass your hotel project? What type of hotel you want to set up? as for example in terms of 5 star, 4 star and so on. Secondly, in terms of restaurant or you want only restaurant business etc. Next, what are the facilities you want to offer in your hotel? What are the documents that you need to prepare and submit to get approved your license? What are the steps to get approved your application? What are the types of licenses that you are needed to run a hotel business? Once approved, then how long will be valid and again, what is the procedure of re -enroll your hotel license? How to fix the rate of your hotel services, etc. Now come to the next level, that is, to run a hotel business, you will be employing certain number of employees. So, what are the employment rules, that is labor law? What are the responsibilities that you need to take care of your employees? What are the employees' rights over which you need to pay attention? What are the employees' insurance schemes? What to do if something wrong happens with your employee? And what are the employees' responsibilities towards their employers? Now, come to the third level. That is, to run a hotel business, you need to face 
public, that is your clients, customers, or better to say guests directly. So you need to establish a direct public relation in such a case. How to build a good relationship with your guests? What are the responsibilities that you owe towards your guests? How to treat to the guest who doesn't pay your bill? In your hotel, people of different cultural regions will come and they may speak different languages. In such a case, how to treat these foreigner guests? What to do if something wrong happens to your guest? Though the list of these questions mentioned above is not inclusive, but of course it is exclusive and all these questions are either directly or indirectly related to the law. And this is why you need to understand the meaning of law in your hotel study program. However, the following points will make you understand better. That is, well, don't get afraid. The introduction of law in your course never meant to make you a lawyer, but to know certain rules and regulations that you more often required in your hotel business. Since this is a business of direct public relation, therefore it is very sensitive and you need to know certain rules and rights of yours as well as of your guests and that you can know only through learning the law. So, law in your course is just an introductory legal information that deliberately fabricated in your curriculum to build a strong knowledge base so that you can run your hotel business smoothly and ultimately make your career successful in the future. Moreover, to know the answers of these questions mentioned above, keep watching.